Back to softball now, and Minster senior third baseman Marissa Conrad's helmet is adorned with stickers, decals for home runs, extra base hits, and RBI, with several more on the way after her 3-for-5 with two runs and two ribbies in yesterday's dramatic 4-3 10-inning semifinal victory. Her helmet also says, stay humble, stay hungry. Perhaps apt words for a program that is looking to add their first state title to the school's list of 27 state team champions. Minster fans patiently waiting to get in at Firestone Stadium. Top of the second, no score. Callie Gottemiller with the leadoff double, but would later get, or leadoff single would later get doubled up. Go to the bottom of the third, runner on, but Kayla Richard gets the strikeout as we had a pitcher's duel in Akron. Top of the fourth, Minster runner on second. Gotta Miller, grounder up the middle. Rachel Heckman scores 1-0 Minster as the junior Gotta Miller with both of the Wildcat hits today. Bottom of the fourth, Redskins runner on third. Pitcher Meredith Chopka helping out her own cause. A fly ball to right. Kathy Pringer makes the catch, but it's deep enough for Dana Denner to score. And we are tied at one. Top of the seventh, still a 1-1 game. I'll go to the bottom of the seventh with a runner on third, two outs, and Brittany Nero. The base hit in the left field, pinch runner Morgan Orlowski scores 2-1 the final as Minster loses on a walk-off. The thrill of victory and the agony of defeat right there as the Wildcats, a fantastic season, comes to an end as they lose 2-1 the final.